Well, generally speaking, fertilizers are not dangerous by their very nature. They are, most of them are what we call a consumer grade quantity or consumer grade commodity, consumer grade commodity. Um, and generally speaking, those are less dangerous for them. They have less chemicals, that type thing. Where we get into problems with these are in manufacturing facilities or storage facilities that have large quantities of fertilizers uh, and may even have some of the commercial grade quantities or the commercial grade commodities. These commercial grades then have a higher contents of chemicals. Fertilizers have an oxidizer component to them. Anything that's on fire, an oxidizer accelerates the combustion process. Uh, therein lies the danger. It's with that accelerated combustion. Uh, we get into further problems when these fertilizers or the ammonium nitrates are on fire, they actually tend to break down and if they are under pressure, that's where we get detonation from something like that. Right, Exploded. right. And again, that was a manufacturing facility, so they probably had the pure form of those contents and chemicals there. The nitrates, again, accelerated the combustion, which made for a hotter fire and that heat combined with the pressure of the vessel that those chemicals are in would cause that detonation problem. And here in Jefferson City, the fire department is aware of the locations where things like that are stored. We don't have vast quantities of high grade uh, fertilizers and, and chemical components like that here in town. But if we do have a fire involving those, you know, evacuation is gonna be the key. We want to evacuate as many people as possible, as soon as possible and limit the life loss. The, the property loss will just be what it is. If we have to let the fire burn itself out, we will. We want to ensure that life safety is addressed and we want to make sure that the public is not harmed. Again, you're dealing with a product that's going to oxidize and it's going to increase combustion, which is going to add to the heat of the fire, make it a hotter fire. Uh, it puts firefighters at risk, not only for thermal injuries and that type thing, but also that detonation problem. So again, evacuation is the key. We are, not, we are not going to put our firefighters at risk. The Department of Transportation guidebook that we use indicates to us that fighting fires should be done from remote locations.